went over this last week. Okay. We know, for those of you who have been waiting, the reason you have been waiting that we already know is you should know that you're either stuck in review or uh, your refund is missing information. Um, it's mistakes may be on there as well. They may be waiting on information from you. You might be audited. Um, some of you are in CPO5, which it might be a simple math medical error that the IRS has to correct on their end. Also, it might be suspicious activities by banks. And I went over all of this on the last live video uh, to help you guys. If you're new to me watching and you haven't watched the other video that I go in more detail to help you guys make sure that you go back to those live videos as well. Now, um, as I am moving on, because I'm trying to move quickly on the slide, again, some of you are getting different dates. Some of you may have this due date, the 19th. Some of you might have the 20, which most people are having the 20 because this is a holiday. Okay. Federal holiday, June 10th. So um, a lot of you are having the 20th um, and some people have contacted me and I already said that their money is already in their bank accounts, which is very good. I congratulate you guys for that. People have also have been contacting me about their amended returns, you guys. And you see on the screen that somebody has been waiting a good while um, for their amended return um, from March, but they also received that it was adjusted so hopefully for those of you who are watching and uh, you're waiting on the amended returns we know the amended returns can take up to 20 weeks or more but some people get this that file during this tax season and they filed a minute return some of them have got their re refunds quicker and they're letting me know as well so I wanted to go over the amended return and let you guys know that some of you who did amend your return and this tax season in 2024 are seeing a little bit more earlier than last year. Some people who amended theirs for 2022 are still waiting, uh, you guys. So I'm just letting you know, um, those who have amended them, be on the lookout for your refund as well, because a lot of people letting me know they're, they're getting it quicker because some people tell you it's been up to a year and they still haven't received that amended refund so i just want to keep y'all updated regarding that. if you have any questions comment definitely drop it down in the video okay i'm moving fast contact for those of you who may need help with your refund some people have told me in the comments that they ended up amending their amending their tax return and i don't recommend this because the irs re doesn't recommend this unless they tell you to amend it but some people have put in the comments that they did amend their tax refund and they had been waiting and then later he got updated i'm not telling you to do none of this Everything you do is your choice. I'm just sharing information from um, people who have come in to let me know and also from the IRS and the IRS website to let you know what's going on and also through experience as well, you guys. So contact the taxpayer advocate, you guys, for those of you who may need help. I also have a video regarding the taxpayer advocate and information regarding what you should do and the steps you need to take when you're trying to see if they will accept you. All right the taxpayer advocate can help you so i just want to let you guys know that if your refund is re reduced um if you're experiencing hardship you need to reach out to the taxpayer advocate okay also congressman house.gov or senator.gov i've been telling you guys that shared videos went step by step sharing people how and what to do by your state congressman reach out submit the form and then they're going to reach back out to you make sure you have your email that you uh, check your email and your spam folder also make sure the number that you provided for them to contact you by phone and you're answering any strange number that they may contact you for that you don't recognize okay you guys also don't forget when you reach out to your congressman if they tell you that they need your social security uh, information, your tax return and all that, that's, they need to have all the information to verify that it's you so that they can talk to the IRS on your behalf. That's why all of that information is important, you guys, as well. Um, also, the IRS, um, the amended, this is the amended tax return, you guys, number if you want to contact, but y'all so can check your amended return on iris.gov and i know a lot of you already know that but i wanted to share this information you guys to help you 
Um, the IRS number 1-800-829-1040. I also had another number with an extension, but a lot of people said that they will put on hold. Let me see if I still have that number available. I think I took that number down that I shared with the 1-800 with the extension, you guys. But there's a extension that you can reach somebody. You can comment when this video go off if you would like that number with the extension. You might be on there about an hour or more on hold, but I will share that number in case you're trying to reach somebody in person. Again, if you have any questions and comments, drop them down in the video. If you have a text offset, as well that can hold up your tax return so for those of you who are new again if you don't know about a tax office set you call that 1-800-304-3107 number to see if you have a tax offset also don't forget for those of you they're telling me that tpg santa barbara tax product bank um some people are not being um receiving their direct deposit in their bank accounts and they're issuing the checks back to the irs the different banks because of suspicious activity um that's why they'll mail you a check a lot of people say they selected direct deposit but they're getting checks from the irs and that's probably the reason why they mail you out a check it takes seven to ten business days you guys to receive that if they send you a check so i'm trying to cover everything in this live video to help you guys as well um let me see okay for those of you if you have any comments and questions, again, you can drop them down in the video or when it goes off again, because I know that everybody is celebrating June 10th, okay? I know everybody is celebrating June 10th today, so a lot of people are at events. Um, but for those of you who contacted me about partnership with me, again, um, I'll be opening that in August, you guys, to those who want to be tax preparers and get on board with me. Um, if you are interested in partnering with me um, as a tax preparer, you can send your resume to my email address, you guys, and I'll definitely get back to you um, within August to let you guys know. For those of you who have no experience, but you still have the passion and want to help others, 